Good morning, five minute traders. I want to bring up a chart of Chipotle. Chipotle has been hit again with, it's down as you can see here, another $17. This is when uh, the last couple days it got hit, went from 400 down to, uh, where did it go? Like 366 and today we were further. I haven't even seen the news this morning. I don't really care. I always just come back to the charts and what they tell me. Um, one of the things that I've noticed here is that Chipotle is at a, it's, it's at a key juncture here, and I, I was just bringing up the, the weekly chart. I was reading, I was reading, this got me prompted. I, I saw, I know Chipotle was getting hit on botulism scares. Listen, in, you know, in less than five weeks, somebody knew about this because it was $500. Now it's back down to the low. The interesting thing here is, I'm, as I wait for uh, this to populate here on the chart, you'll see we're right at a little hole that if we don't hold here this morning, right at 356, we could go down another $20. If we do that, I'd be probably short-term interested in buying this uh, either today, Friday, here it is, or Monday. And, and what I'm talking about, it could easily, you see this one big block here, nothing really compared to everywhere else has traded. So if we break through 353, um, I could expect to see this go much lower. So well, the market's getting hit here pretty hard as we open. So we want to just throw this out there that uh, look at buying some calls, possibly some in the money, 300 or $320 strikes, if this breaks through another level, because I think it'll hold in here. This is a weekly chart. It should hold the 300, 320 level. So this is my guidance. Uh, you know, I was reading a, a, a price, price economics article that was talking about, um, it was talking about the fact that, um, you know, in America we have so much Mexican heritage and, and different parts of the country eat burritos and eat tacos. Well, here on the West Coast, it's definitely different styles of burritos from California up to Washington. I'm here in Oregon and I'm a burrito fan. So my favorite meal at Chipotle is a burrito. Uh, I'm not afraid of the botulism scare. I like the company. Uh, it was definitely overvalued here. We needed a reason to sell off. And now when you really look at this chart, you start to see, well, you know, if if it breaks through that hole, again, then I'm, I am get kind of interested 300 to, to 320 uh, for a bounce trade. And then, you know, really, it, it could go all the way down to 220 again. So you have to be aware. And that's why I would use a, a fixed uh, call product. And yeah, we're trying to catch a knife out here a little bit, but people aren't going to stop eating. They like this food in America, especially... I'm, I'm a fan of Chipotle. If you get an opportunity to pick it up at a discount, this is the time to do it. So keep this in mind. Uh, love to hear from you. Uh, burrito or taco? And what kind of burrito are you a fan of? Uh, send me an email, matt at one minute trader TV. Listen, have a great weekend. I'm going to make this video kind of short today, but it's a pretty simple idea. If we can break through 350 and get down to the 335 area, Start looking to pick up some Chipotle via the options. And again, you could backspread, um, meaning, you know, you, you could actually, uh, uh, you know, buy, sell some puts and uh, sell some stock at the same time if you want, you know, if you're more advanced. But I'm not going to get into the details of that here. Look to buy some calls straight up, you know, if you don't want to buy the stock. Uh, I think that uh, is the easiest way to do it. And as this gets hit, these should, the, the calls should get uh, should get their uh, volatility uh, should should increase, and they should get crushed. So uh, think about that. If it breaks through 350, alert yourself. Again, you can see as the as it opens here, it's it's kind of holding, and um, we'll see what happens. So have a great weekend. We'll see you next week here at the Five Minute Trader, and uh, we hope you're enjoying uh, the summer, getting out there, having fun. And uh, we will talk to you next week.